tucked away at Iowa State University's Christian Peterson Art Museum at Morrill Hall, is the REACT Gallery. The REACT Gallery is a space for communication of expressing and exploring reactions and opinions on current events and issues that are being featured. April 2nd marked the first day of the First Amendment exhibit being held at the REACT Gallery. David Fox, the interpretation specialist with the University Museums, believes that there is an importance in having a space and exhibit that allows students to express their reactions. Well, the uh, REACT Gallery is something that's been going on all year uh, with uh, uh, thematic and specific exhibitions with a focus on utilizing the art in our permanent collection as well as borrowed materials uh, and also collaborating with partners around campus and collecting their materials to create a space that uh, brings together these materials both aesthetically and uh, uh, thematically in, in hopes that we can create a reaction that we could, people will come in see these works of art see the the curatorial work uh, of the exhibition but also uh, within that scope of our partners, what they're doing on campus, and, and hopefully generating some sort of a reaction. And with that reaction, showcasing the different opportunities those that come in have on acting, on those feelings that they're getting, on those questions that they have. This REACT uh, exhibition to finish off the year is on the First Amendment. We partnered with the Greenlee School of Journalism uh, and uh, had uh, works of art within our collection that uh, my boss, Nancy Gephardt, reached out to different faculty members and folks within Greenlee School uh, to decide which objects they would like to have uh, to help facilitate that discussion on what exactly is the First Amendment, why it's important, and how it affects students' life and campus life. The First Amendment Day exhibit will be open through April 27th and is free to the public. For iState News with Keaton Lane, this is Jordan Prince.